Last time on Zero Mission, it was a doozy of an episode. <laughs> we fought Ridley right off the bat, way early on in the stream. We tried to get some more items in Norfair and in Ridley's, I don't know, cavern, whatever you want to call it. But then we decided to go to the point of no return and go into Turian and fight the brain, the mother brain, except not the mother brain because it didn't have legs, it wasn't walking around yet. And now we're here, the game's not over. And we've got cool uh, Zero Suit Samus sprite. Just, just a pistol and a dream. Mistake, welcome in, how's it going? It's good to see you. I was, uh, I was definitely feeling frustrated on Monday, but I'm ready to jump back in. I just needed, like, a fresh start for this section of the game. This should be really interesting. Okay. What is this charge thing, too? Can I charge my shot? I don't think so. Metal Gear Samus. Right, right. I'm busy working, boy, so I'll be doing a work and wine lurk. Okay, nice. Good luck, Mystique. Thanks for lurking and hanging out. I feel like the volume's a bit louder today, but maybe that's just this section of the map. I'll try to sit a little closer so my mic picks up my voice better. Oh, what is that behind me? It's like a heat ray. Oh, <gasps> you can follow me? And you can crawl in the little tunnels? This is brutal. I think we're gonna die immediately. This is our first battle of... Maybe we're not supposed to fight. I should probably just keep running. That makes a lot more sense. I think it's that kind of area, not fight, even though we are armed. Austin, welcome in. How's it going? I'm gonna wait for this space pirate to turn. Does it move every time I move? Does it hear us? No. We're gonna see what happens. Oh. Oh. Oh, I do have to go up. And everybody's still chasing us through here. I wonder if there's... Oh, wait. A way to not do that part? What? What is that for? Weird. The music's cool now. Chase music. I think this is a laser. The chase music's so intense. Hey, Spirit Crystal, welcome in. Yeah, this is. Oh, cool. Indeed, intense. Oh, we missed part of the map, though. Oh, well, no going back now. Oh, this is so weird. Neil! Ugh! Oh, this is stupid. This is gonna be all of dread, isn't it? It's the whole thing is chase scene. We missed so much of the map. It's like Jaws and Final Fantasy Battle Mashup. Here, open this door for me. Oh, well, we don't have very much health. Okay, let's try again. I think there's... There's a... There's a better method to this. I still don't understand, though, this room? How you're supposed to... Jump down? 
and not get caught. I feel like as soon as our feet hit the ground, that was it, even if they're turned the other way. Okay, that room we know how to do. This one, they like let us go. And then I don't understand why there's a breakable floor there. Maybe for the escape, I, I don't know. We died so many times during this part. Ooh, we'll see. I think I'm just gonna have to memorize it. Also, N dude, hi, welcome in. Oh yeah, this part with the um the lasers are a trap. So if we tr if we trick the one to the left, can we go up that way? And this floor is going to give out below us, right? So should we just go first down here? Oh, but I don't think we can move on. Okay. I don't know. Oh, there's like a secret room down there. I want to go this way. What is it? Is it worth it? It's a crumble block? Is this just a dead end? Oops. We lose health so quickly. We're so squishy without our armor. Oh, I forget I need this. Oh, it froze you. Sometimes we get ice. We're exploring. We're gonna find all the rooms, apparently. <laughs> hey, Sankari, welcome in. Duder, welcome in. Alright, I don't see the point in not jumping down for that part. Oops. Oh, rip! So bad with my controls. Oh, but I guess it does. It's just a trap, maybe. Like you might fall back down on top of that pirate. So for this room, I want to know what's over here. It says we're supposed to go up. Is this crumble blocks? Oh, power bomb. Oh, did I just get them to shoot each other? Weird. Oh, right. this time, or at least I tried. Okay, go away. Bye! And then what did we do in this room? Just realized the cursor of the game over screen is Samus without the helmet on. Yeah, and in the start screen with our save file, it was uh, the same thing. It was pretty cute. 
I don't know. I don't think we need to go that way yet. I'm guessing we get to come back to some of these rooms later. Go, 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 go! That one got stuck behind the door. Did we get a break yet? Yeah, because you think we're not here. Whew. Is there anything up top? right there I think we get a save at some point too oh we just passed it no okay maybe we have to go left and around Is this gonna be a crumble block right here? Yeah. Okay, nice. Oh, and it refills. Yay! I like that. Love the sneaking through the air ducts. Yeah! It's really cool. It's really, um, so different that they put this in here. Is this above? No, it's somewhere we haven't been yet. Should we go down there first? I feel like there's gonna be stuff that we can't get to yet. Because we don't have our stuff. This looks like rumble blocks too. I don't know that I want to fall down. And this is everything's breakable. Are they crumble blocks or all oh, stuff that I can't break anyways? So then is this? Oh, interesting. I have to go down anyways. Maybe this will give us our missiles back if I go down here. Oh, here, go right. Oh. Can't help but feel like we missed some stuff. Uh, okay. They'll never find me in here. Weird. What is that? Spotlights? Oh, they're very flashy. I actually think we have, what is it? F, F, L, exclamation point F, L. That's a flashing light warning. But we got spotted pretty quickly, so uh. It stopped the flashing lights, which is good. Oh, okay. 
Well, this is bad. Was there a way to trick you in that room? Aw, boo. I think it's F FW, maybe? Oh. We had one at one point. There it is. Where'd she go? I know, they lose track of me so quickly. had to drop down here and they found us right after oh it, okay I didn't test that block below us before but it was something that we can't get to yet they saw me oh what's over there nothing just getting them to run in circles how are we supposed to do this part? Hmm. Maybe not get caught by these spotlights this time? Oh shit. This part, I don't understand. We just get stuck in this little... Do we have to get here without hitting those lights? Is that why? I don't get it. I guess so. It's so different. I miss, like, normal Metroidvania mode. Like, I don't know. This is cool, but... I miss the usual. <laughs> Nintendork, welcome in. How's it going? Is that a block? No, I think we tested most of that wall. Okay. This way. Oh, there is a breakable wall behind you. Can I get you to jump down and then I jump back up? And table, how's it going? Welcome in. Oh, I thought. Oh, okay. It's like missiles above me. Never mind. Nice seeing more people giving this game love. Yeah. It's, um. It's, it's interesting. It's such an interesting... Everything, like, feels the same as other games we've played, but then it's its whole own game. And this part is so different. Yeah, chaos. <laughs> the spotlights, at least on mobile, they weren't flashing at all. Oh, interesting. Okay, good to know. This is a part where we get to pause. So now we have to get to the part with the spotlights again. A sign of a good remake. Feels familiar but different. Yeah. Are you wanting the more usual experience? It was certainly experiment. It's cool. It's cool. I wasn't ready to be done with the other part yet, but it's very experimental and fun. This loops back around to a room that we won't we don't want to go back to. 
but it gives us a nice pause. It feels like dread, I know, that's what I was saying. Like, is this gonna be the whole dread experience is one big chase sequence? I think that's kind of the point, right? Oh, I see. There's a wall up there, but I don't think we can break it. And this is open now. Good. And we can save again. Good. Celestial, welcome in. How's it going? We're back at it again today. We've got fresh attitude and expectations, and it's a whole new game, pretty much, compared to what we've already played. Save! Yes, exactly. I hate Chaser escape parts. Me too, and table normally. This one's at least not timed, but chasing, escaping Zebes after the mother brain fight is the most stressful thing in the whole world. That's <laughs> so tense. You saw when we did it on Monday, the look of defeat in my eyes that I'm like, we're not gonna make it out alive. <laughs> and then we barely did. Chai, welcome in. Good morning. Chase sequences are so stressful. They really are. Going good. Happy to back and see the return of the mothership. Yeah. Okay. What? Uh, I don't want to trip any of these. But if I fall, there's a horizontal one. Have we already jumped down here? We did. Yeah. And I don't know if there's one below here, because we can't see underneath our feet. So maybe we will not go down there. I didn't realize the back of the Zero Suit is actually pink. I think in some versions it's, it's red. If you missed the beginning of stream, I did like Zero Suit nails today. But they have red over the blue instead of pink. We can do pink next time. Hey, Thief of Hope, welcome in. Um, we fought not the f entire Mother Brain fight that I'm familiar with, but we, we did get out of Zebes. Kind of cool to see a weak, vulnerable Samus, yeah. Uh, I have not played Fusion yet. No, that's the next game on our list. Oh, can I make this jump? I think I'm gonna bonk my head. I wonder, oh, I'm not good enough to like drop down and then wall jump off of the thing I'm standing on. Beat Mother Brain, though Samus was shot down while escaping the planet. It's still Mother Brain. It just doesn't feel like the same Mother Brain because it's a different fight. Oh God. <laughs> oh, we made it through there without getting any of those wires. I wanna go back and explore that room. Oh, look at this. What is this? Why is this special hidden? I don't know. Otefu, welcome in. Thanks for thanking the mods. Stepmother brain. <laughs> nice save on the crumble blocks. I feel like this room right here is going to, uh, we're gonna trip some kind of wire. Cabrera, welcome in. How's it going? No wire, just a space pirate. Okay, that's exciting. I'm just gonna keep running. Oh, this is so cool looking. There's so many pirates after us, though. Yeek! Yeah, we'll just come down here. This is cool. We missed so much of the map! Can I not save? Oh. <laughs> Uh-huh. 
Very cool. <laughs> Getting good at platooning, platforming. We're get, we're we're definitely improving platforming with uh with zero mission and zero suit, Samus. Thank you, Magus, for the <laughs> love those moments. Yeah. Indeed, the big room with all the trip lasers is very tough. We. I'm glad I was cautious then. I wanted to explore, but I resisted the urge to explore every c corner of the map because I figured we would just get caught. Oh, not the lights again. Yeah, it's a stealth game now. Isn't that cool? Yes, 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 yes. Uh, Nintendork, thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. It auto-corrected? Yeah, it does that sometimes. <laughs> Right. Ooh, okay, there's one up there. Maybe let's go this way. Oh, okay, there's one over there. And I see a enemy up above us. So Oh shit. Oh god. It's gonna catch us anyway, right? Oh my god. <laughs> you get stuck between those two. I'm assuming I have to make it past without getting caught by the light. Oh, this is a dead end. Unless you can hide up there, maybe. Oh nice, it still crawled through that tunnel even though I didn't go all the way in that room. That felt very scuffed. Go, go. Oh, shoot. Run away, run away, run away! Oh, <laughs> oh okay, nice. Oh. False sense of hope. Do we have to do like a big loop now? Yeah. Oh, stressful. I remember this part. It was really hard when I was young. I can imagine. I'd be, I'd be so stressed out. I would not have played this game as a kid. It's too scary. Dramatic music is very dramatic, indeed. Oops, I meant to just let that one come down this hallway. I don't remember what we did last time to avoid it. Oh, not that. Oh, shit. Well, rip. I'm missing that wall jump every time, but maybe they'll just hang out down there now and have a party on their own. Oops. Ugh. Oh right, this room. Bye! No? You both come up here? Can you just leave me alone? Thank you. Move silently. <laughs> uh, I feel like a lot of stealth sections resort to either immediate failure or letting you fight back, and I kind of like the compromise of needing to run, but being able to take some hits. Yeah. Thank goodness for energy tanks being more like cybernetic implants. Yeah! I know our health right now. At least we have a bunch of energy tanks. What is that? Do we have to hang out right here? I assume? I guess we'll find out. Wee! Flashing lights, flashing lights. Ooh, hi! Oh, it caught my foot! <laughs> goodness. The genre ex expectation problems, typical of stealth sections, but I'm glad they try to figure out how to make it more interesting. The decorations on the wall, 
Makes me think of ancient Egyptian paintings. Yeah. That sort of Chozo vibes in general. Alright, we get to do this part again. Maybe with fewer hits. Uh, hi! Okay. It would have been nice to get one of those jumps. No, no, go higher. There you go. Oh shit. No, I could have gone under it. Oh well. No, just drop down, thanks. Oh, I think you can lose one of them in that room. Because there was like a block in the way, but... We'll just do this again. Turns out while feet are lava proof, they're still visible, yeah. One of the recent Dread trailers had similar hieroglyphic style wall art, yeah. Uh, Chuck, hi, welcome in. It's good to see you. This room. So I think the reason we can hang onto the wall of this lower set of blocks is because it doesn't the eye doesn't keep moving downward but the other one it keeps going down and scanning and scanning and scanning so we can hang out here and then I guess jump up maybe oh not like that Oh well, maybe we'll just try to go through this section. Oh. Oh god. Don't like. Are you stuck down here once you get to this point? Yeah. Strange that the stream isn't capturing the yellow eye very well. Yeah. Some things it doesn't like, and some things, uh... Some things come out okay. I think it depends what resolution you're watching. This part's trial and error, yeah. That's, I mean, I'm in no rush to get through it. We're just gonna have to learn it bit by bit. Oh yeah, this is where we got caught before, because I, I don't know, messed it up. I dorked it up. But now we're not caught. So normally this part is closed. And then this, we're usually getting chased. But now we're not. Wow. It's fun to see you learning the sneakiness. We're trying. Muffins, hi, welcome in. Bren, thank you for 14 months. Welcome back to the human race. Enjoy Earth Badger emotes, your ad free viewing. We're very glad to have you. Happy Wednesday. Thanks for the resub. Playing at 30 FPS makes it so the yellow lights don't flash. Oh, gotcha. Uh, please, Nintendork, I don't want any hints or tips or help. We've, we've done the oops, the first command a couple times now, uh, just, just so you're aware. I'm not looking for any extra advice, I'm just gonna go through at my own pace. Muffins, how's your Wednesday going? Here, should we, um, is that something that I can fix really quickly? Let me see. If we can get rid of the... Oh, no. It didn't like that. Okay, well. Here for the struggle bus, yeah. Oh, you're good. Thanks, Nintendork. Thanks for understanding. Changing playback settings. Oh, for, like, chat. Oh, okay. 
if you want to watch at 30 FPS instead, you should be able to uh, skip the flashing lights. Hey, Bonin, welcome in. Achieved the effect by turning it off and on every other frame, which looked okay on older monitors, but not on emulator. Yeah. Hi, by the way, Jen. <laughs> okay. Heretic, hi, welcome. So much, so much, uh, helpful, so many helpful hints from chat. Oh, we can explore this room now. I don't know that I really want to. I kind of want to just keep going. This room's really hard, though. I forget what I did here. I didn't really accomplish much. How high up do you go? But it doesn't matter. I have to go in front of you, because otherwise you'll get me on the way back down. Oh, but I already... Oh, this is weird. to do there. So now we crawl, 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 shoot. Crawl, 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 shoot. Shoot. And go. Whee! And hide. Aw! Lame. Oh, there was a hidden room over there, too. Wait, where? How does that room work? We just keep going? No? Oh! So many secrets! Nope, go, go, go! Oh shit. I'm not fast enough. Ooh, look at the fancy statue! What the heck? Are you done chasing me now? Yeah, go back to your post. Thank you. Dun, 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 dun. Look in the remastered music. Nice. Uh, Carl, how's it going? Just replayed a couple weeks ago. Nice. This game would stress me out so much. I know, Bonin, I'm trying to just be as... A as, as unrushed as possible and zen out because normally this would stress me out a ton power never die welcome in oh it's gone now well rip the statue is just hello you <laughs> um I want to know what's over in this room that was ah okay good Good, good, good. Save, please! I played this last year as my first Metroid game. Really enjoyed it. Nice! Do, 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 do. Chuck, thank you for gifting a sub to Maggie. I appreciate it. Maggie, welcome back to the human race. Enjoy your Earth Badge, your emotes, your ad previewing. We're very glad to have you. It wouldn't be the human race without you. Thank you, Chuck. Oh, Austin, that's perfect! Is this, um... Oh, that's great. Uh, this is not my first Metroid game. This is my third Metroid game. We've played Super Metroid, Metroid Prime, and this one. The relief of finding a save. This is wonderful. Oh, I think somebody... Yeah, somebody answered it for you. Thanks, Otefu. Okay. Oh, they're carrying it. Give it back. 
Are you just walking away from me? I'm supposed to chase you? Yeah. Good thing I didn't say something. Hang on. Uh, about fusion and spoil it? Yeah. We're playing fusion next. All my playthroughs of the other Metroids we've done so far are on YouTube. This one's going on YouTube as well. Fusion will go there as well. Uh, but in the meantime, we're working through this on stream. Okay, well... Interesting. Very interesting. Oh, is this one gonna come all the way up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I thought... Okay, rip. It's fine. I thought I had space to jump there. Clearly I did not. This is gonna be a bad time. I need to do like a circle to get around you. Or do friendly fire, that's good. Uh, Carl, thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. Welcome in. Oh, I should have just run under you there. This part sucks. I'm glad we have a save. Love the friendly fire moments. Oh, I can't go through there yet? Or at all? I don't know how this area... We're crawling buddies, look at us go! <laughs> oh shoot. I didn't jump. Awesome, thank you Muffins, thank you for uh, letting us know that that's working out. Friendly fire happens, I can't help but giggle. <laughs> Almost, yeah it's okay. We learned the route that we're taking, I think. Glad that so many people are getting into Metroid, especially after Dread was announced. Many of us waited almost 20 years. I know, I know. We we had played um, Super before the announcement. We were getting into Metroid anyways, but the announcement came at the perfect time. It was on you, yeah. <laughs> Oh, Semi, welcome in. Hello, hello. When does this one on the right turn around? It hits that wall and turns. Oh, go, go, go. Nice. Oh, but there's gonna be one on the right. Does it come all the way down to this corner? Uh. <laughs> Shouldn't have hesitated. We made it. Never been as hyped for a game as I am for Dread. That's awesome. Oh, hi. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky! Oh, we're in the shadows here, I think. I don't know how to get around that one on the right, though. Can I just shoot it? <laughs> I don't think that'll fare well for us. Holly, hi, welcome in. And I can't- I can't shoot it from here. I think I just have to wait for it to go off screen. Oh. There's like just enough shadow right here that it doesn't see us. Oh, rip. It's fine. We got further than we did last time. Oh no! Ah! Just when you think your jumping is going really well. How much can we wall jump through this room? Alright, forget it. Leave me alone! Crawling buddies again. Lakitu, welcome in. Ah, I'm so... I, I keep, like, falling at the last second. Even though we get a bunch of jumps in a row. 
I need to remember, so we crawl through that other section with the spotlights and you just keep going left. There's, like, I don't think there's any reason for me to try to go up. Well, maybe there's items or something, I don't know, but. Yes, 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 yes. Blade, how's it going? Welcome in. Uh, Dark Lord, thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. I hear Super Metroid is good. I should play, says me, for the last 15 years. It is very good. My first was Prime Trilogy version. Yeah. Okay. We have to do that other part again, which I'm sad because I was successfully sneaky. Hopefully I can duplicate it. This part right here, we somehow manage. I forget what I did here. I think we just had to... Oh, shoot. Reset. Wait, does it turn around? Oh, it turns around! Okay, never mind. This eyeball, though. Are we hidden here? I don't think so. Oh, nice. It doesn't go all the way to the bottom of the corner. Wall jumping is a suburb for a blind run, please. You flatter me too much. I do like wall jumping. I don't <laughs> I don't always like fully execute it. You know, we do a bunch of wall jumps at a, at a row and then I choke on the last like top part of the corner. Hi Sykes, not gonna lie, part of me thought the title implied you were doing zero suit cosplay. Oh, yet. <laughs> Maybe someday. Not today. This is a death free run. Yeah. <laughs> Invader Jim, hi. Welcome. I don't like Metroid 1 much. Okay. Uh, this part I'm just kind of sneaking by. I still don't know how to do this. I kind of want to shoot at this one on the bottom level. Oh, it does work. Okay, nice. I didn't wait until that other one turned around. Can we go this way? No, I tried that the first time. I already forgot, though. We should just go here. And then go left, left, left. And up. Not yet! Metroid 1 was a good stepping zone to get into overall better games. We get to try it. At the end of this one, I've been told we unlock it. I'm just gonna jump down and run, 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 run. Oops, don't wall jump here. Just jump on the cubes. Oh, shoot. Stop it. All right, we're dead. There's so many of them. I wish they would stop shooting at me. <laughs> Nestroid's a proto Metroidvania. Yeah. That's how you tried it after you beat this one? Nice. Yeah, that's the plan is we're going to try it. We're just going to have a little Nestroid sampler just to see <laughs> we're not committing to the full game no way could definitely see trying metroid 1 like many nes games i think of it as fun to play not to beat yes we get to play it and i think we'll appreciate it because there's so many um references in axiom verge as well to the original. And I'll go, oh, that's what they were pulling from for Axiom Verge. And it will be a triumph. Oh, this one? Oh, okay. This part, in my opinion, when you're playing it for the first time is a little frustrating. Yeah, it is a bit. It is a bit. Um, I want to wait for you to go back down. ZM's hard mode is no joke. Oh, I'm sure. need to work on embracing playing but not beating games sure nothing wrong with that 
The damage in the NES game is so ridiculous. It's easy to show you how to enter Nestroid's secret world. Yeah, I would like to see that. Maybe we'll get by this one this time. I keep thinking that the one on top can't see us when it turns its back, but okay, nice. Uh, but it turns around. Even if you jump when it's got its back turned, it turns around. I know, we talked about how you can die in the room transitions in Metroid 1. That's so frustrating. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we took some hits. Just keep running! Go, 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 go! Go, 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 go! Oh, really? So now what? We have to hide in one of these? Oh, those are all crumble blocks, though. That sucks. I need to- I need to explore around here, then. And see, can't you like jump and then re jump again on those? No? Oh, pfft. Okay, that was stupid. The music stopped, but I had already moved on. Because I didn't hear it stop quick enough. Musically, welcome in. How's it going? Yeah, we, ta we talked about the 30 health. Yeah, I know. It's really, um, it's really tough. Nestroid is brutal. We've talked about AM2R as well, yeah. Um, at some point, I might be able to give it a try. So now we know I can run through that whole room and do a big circle, but at some point I have to stop and get them to stop chasing me. Because you can't get to the end of the room. Oops. Oh, that was close. Um, unless that door opens. AM2R should wait the more you play the rest. Yeah, yeah. As a fan game, we should play as many as we can before we get to AM2R. It's, it's on the list, but so far it's this, Fusion, Dread, and then I don't know what order we're going to go in after that. I think we might take a break. I keep saying that and like, oh yeah, we're gonna play some Castlevania. We have Subnautica as well. Totally different game, I know. Completely different genre, but it was um, recommended after we beat Outer Wilds and gifted. So I would like to at least give it a try on stream. Recently beat Metroid 2 on Game Boy for the first time. Nice. It's tough? Okay, gotcha. AM2R is really good. Don't know if you play Metroid 2, but if you have to play that game, go directly to the fan game. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Pew pew. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> friendly fire! Oh, why couldn't it have destroyed the one that comes into this room and chases us? Boo. secret room up here? Alright, well, that's not helping us. How come they don't break the crumble blocks? That's not fair either. Now this part. How are we gonna do this? Hmm. Okay. They were done with us, but then they weren't. Okay, there's not enough of a ledge there to wall jump. I'm not figuring out- oop, misclick. I'm not figuring out where there's a place for me to hide. And they're gonna come- 
back through here. I wonder if there's one... Hmm... Apple Avocado, welcome in. Dun, dun, dun. take a quick water break while I think about this. There's got to be some way to lure them to a spot where we can hide. The pirate keeps taking our goodies, I know. I want my stuff back, dang it. It's all in the wrist, thanks, Celestial. <laughs> Sounds about right. Samus Returns is fantastic. Yeah. I've heard good things. The pose is so dynamic. I love her, um... The Zero Suit sprite is so good. I really like the Zero Suit. It's cool. absolutely love the moment of, hey, you can't do that, after seeing them walk away with it. Every time we get caught there. I wonder if we can do a loop in that vertical hallway. I don't think so. I think we have to do it in this room. I just don't know how yet. Or not this room. The next room. This room, we usually just go past to here. We avoided getting shot that time. That was nice. Still don't know how to do this. Maybe there's one up and to the left over there behind me? Oh. Oh, they're all on top now. Oh god. Oh, and now I can't get up there. That's bad. Okay, we're- we have a pause. Weird. Played Metroid 2 on Virtual Console. Nice. We got this. I think when we walk into this room, there's going to immediately be a pirate facing us. Right? I think it walks up to us right here. Oh, maybe not. So do I just have to go through this way? Oh. Well, let's try it. Interesting. Now we're being sneaky. The other time we were just being chased. Okay. Uh, Chai, I'm gonna have to wait on the cat cameo. If we, if you want us to refund it, we can. Otherwise, I think we're gonna do one at, um, at break today. Because we had a couple people asking, but the cats, like, just settled down before stream. Um, they were being real rowdy today, so I don't want to get them fired up again. We can have one. I'm just gonna save it for the stream break. But I appreciate you redeeming that. Would love to hang out with the cats in a little bit. Okay, so I'm curious though if we're in the clear from here, are there any pirates up on this top level? Can we 
crawl without having a wall above us? No. This is open now. Okay, all right. All right, yay. Oh, and now we can't go back. No return. Oh, thank you, Chai, I appreciate it. One thing I enjoyed about Metroid games are task speed runs, they're so satisfying, yeah. Save. What lies ahead of us? Water level? Weird. And there's still... Okay, missiles. There's still all these gates, so I think if we get- we can still get caught. Ooh, cutscene. What? That's fun. We used to train here. Oh, the art's really neat. Can they give us all our stuff back now? Why is the music so scary? We're fighting the mirror of ourselves? Get it. Okay, this is cool. I'm afraid to shoot at us because it's us. Oh, what the hell? Do we only shoot at when it's glowing that other? Yeah, okay. Weird. Oh my god! <laughs> this is the Chozo ghost fight. Oops. Oh, it happened so quick. I thought I got it! There we go. Oh, I just have to stand there. I was jumping all about. <gasps> Transformation! Yay! Thank goodness. And we got plasma. And we got gravity suit. And we got space jump. Yay. How does space jump work in this game? Oh, it's nice. Oh, okay, unfurl. Yeah. <laughs> Get out of here. Oh wait, we can go through the water now. Do we want to? Do we have to to keep going? Oh. Cool. We can just hang out here for a while. Oh, that's right. No, because we can't backtrack. Yay! Epic music, yeah. Such a great moment. It's revenge time! Oh, 
And then Sam is a brunette. Yeah, the um the Super Metroid sprite. It's more of a brownish, like dirty blonde, darker blonde hair. So when we did a Super Metroid cosplay, I have like a darker blonde wig. But for this one, if I ever do zero suit, I feel like I have to go full yellow hair. <laughs> Holly, thank you for the host. I appreciate it. Yay, gravity suit. Yay, more supers. The immediate payoff, I love that. I was very curious, like why do they have this whole entire level with all these blocks labeled with missiles and we never get our missiles in here? I was very confused. So that looks like a secret, right? Oh, no. It's just a one-way back. They do that a lot in this game. You think it's a secret, and then... It's, um, just a faster way to get through the room. She was a redhead in Metroid 1. She dyes her hair a lot. Right, I don't have to wall jump so much anymore. I have aha. Uh oh. Aha. Suspicious. Is that the way we came in? Are there crumble blocks here? Oh, we don't have that yet. suspicious. Which way are we gonna want to go? Uh, left first and then right, I think. I think we are gonna try to go back and get all of the items. Uh, we're, we're gonna 100% it if we can. Or at least mess around with it and try. Oh, that's like a secret way back into the rest of the other part of the map. If I want to go back and check it out and get the sections we missed. I feel like we might as well, right? Because at this point we're fully upgraded. Can we damage these? Yeah, you can shoot everything now. The music doesn't change. Let's go to this room below us that we never finished. Oh. We can't go through if we're... Okay, there we go. The aha moments are so great. Yeah, that's what I love. Didn't try that one, but it seems pretty hard. Oh, the, um... The ending, the the low percent ending, yeah. It says there's an item in here. Interesting. Ha! 
supers. Good. The alarm still goes off. Yeah, but the music's like, we don't care about the alarm. <laughs> A lot of Game Boy Advance games still hold up to this day. Yeah. Um, we have one more room to our right that I kind of want to go back and try out. Oh, I expected to start crawling again. Ha ha ha. Nobody drops any health, though. It's kind of a bummer. Oh, but that's because these fill our health every time. Uh, Nintendo, I know you know a lot about this game. I would maybe just cool it until, like, people are asking questions. You're sending a lot of messages real fast. Give other people a chance to, to chat, too. Is it this room? Yeah. We never went up through here. Oh, it's not that exciting. Oh well. Oh, there was another section of this room above us too. Um... I don't know, there's so much to explore. What do we do next? Let's go back through that way, I guess. Various suits skippable. What did we what did we use the various suit for in this game? Getting through the heat sections? Oh, I thought you had to have very suit for those little bugs. The ones that open doors for you. Oh, it knocked us back. Stop it! Going the right way, right? Yeah, I'm going up. Okay, all right, this room got spicy. and welcome in. Thanks for the cat jams. Oh, there's stuff in this room to the left, too. How do I get through that? Can we not? Oh. So some of it's blocked off by power bombs. Interesting. Oh, then I think I locked myself in. At least this direction. Well, that stinks. I don't remember how we got over here. Those are all breakable, nice. Celestial, thank you for redeeming human kindness. I appreciate it. Sending human kindness from me to you and to chat. Thanks for being here today. I appreciate you. I'm glad to be playing some Metroid with you. And uh, thanks for all the support on this game. I feel like the stealth section was tricky today and we just had a nice time chilling and getting through in it. So thank you. Um, and don't forget you're all loved. Any of these 
blocks. Breakable here. Jedi, thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. And hi. <laughs> the human hello. Yeah, I don't know how I got in this room. It looks like a one-way door. I feel like the maps are uh, pretty good at drawing which rooms are one way. got this item. Meehan, hi, welcome in. So now we're just having to backtrack to the blue section and go the long way around, I think. That's fine. We in the fun part now. Yeah, we're in the revenge part. We took all my stuff, but now we get revenge. Alright, that was a fun loop that served no purpose. Uh, sure, we'll save again. It's over for those chumps, hey Ridley Killer. Congrats on getting through the stealth. Uh, there's certainly some frustrating bits to it, but it was fun seeing some of the shenanigans. Yeah, it's cool. I feel- I feel like it was- if I was taking it maybe more, like, intensely and seriously, it would be a lot more stressful, but they are pretty- pretty, um... What's the word I'm thinking of? Generous with the save rooms, so you have several waypoints along the way. That was really nice. The mothership. Oh, nice. Zen Mindset was trying to. It worked out pretty well. Uh, the sound... Yeah, the Twitch player. Um, it might be the low latency mode issue that we talked about before. Oh, a special upgraded pirate. Are you, like, invincible? Oh, I'm just gonna keep running past you. You're not fun. Oh, those things. Okay, things got a little more intense. Oh, this is the room with the, the gates that we didn't destroy. I'm assuming I can get those with like supers or something, but we just kept moving. Upper casserole, hi, welcome in. You missed the stealth part? Yeah, now it's just pew 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 pew. The nine E tanks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, we'll save. just a spot where we were hiding, probably. A huge glass of milk, hey Shaggy, welcome. No, it's just water. I'm assuming these are missiles up here? No? What is that? Oh. Those ones are missiles. Okay, now where do we have access to? 
Uh, we can keep going up. I wonder what this is. Oh, these robots are back. Do we want to go to the right and finish the tops of those two rooms? Potentially? There's so much stuff in here. Ooh, but you're scary. Oh, I don't know how to get up there yet. I don't know if I can get a... a bomb up at the top there to be able to tell what blocks those are. Maybe... I don't know. Maybe I'll leave it alone for now. this last red square down here. Where is it? Um, if I go to the right and then straight down. I feel like some of these used to be things that I was shooting with the pistol. Maybe the pistol has special bomb power some of the time. No, nope, jump down. Goodness. And then we're trying to go to the bottom of this room that we couldn't before. So need to see the rooms revisited with the tools to plow through, yeah. I know. I'm like, I want to get to every square. Oh, but it's power bomb. We can get to it. Oh. Maybe by like a super duper long way around. Okay. Working on it. Is this a save to our right? No. We want to keep going up. through unless you go up here. Alright, let's save again and then we'll go to a new section. Llama! Hello friends, thank you for the raid! How's it going? How is your stream? Ari, hi! Sebastoy, Ginger Dog, hi friends! Welcome in! I hope you had a good stream. It's always good to see you, Llama. Um, thank you for the shout out, Maggie. Still playing Horizon, Horizon Zero Dawn. Nice. How are you liking the game? I I know you've been um, you've been working at it for a little bit, but it's also a massive game. Really cool world that they built there. Um, if you don't know me, hi, I'm Jen the Human. I like exploration games and Metroidvanias. We are in a very fun section of Zero Mission today. <laughs> Thanks for saying hi to all the raiders. I want to look at my map really quick. Why do I keep getting so turned around? I think we want to go up through here. Oh, I see. We go up and to the left through that, um, red door. Okay, this one. This is where we wanted to go. 
stream is wonderful. We got into a huge new place. I think I've been playing like nine days on stream. Someone said in chat I might be like 10%. Oh my gosh, that game is so big. I'm glad you got to a cool new area. That's always fun. Make new discoveries, see new parts of the map. dog won't stop sniffing the screen where you are he's trying to figure out how you're there <laughs> I love when animals watch TV what huh? it was just invisible before okay wait let's try this again Look at it. How? I feel like we messed up. I don't, I don't want to sleep. I gotta try to figure out how to progress. I can't help but feel like we missed a ton of stuff because I went the wrong way back. We had a chance to go through that water section, I feel like I blew it. get to that. Hmm. Space jump doesn't hurt you? Oh, here. Oh, I should probably go save first, huh? want to save. Ugh. Oh, interesting. Okay, we just need to chill here for a second, I think. Annoying pirates, yeah. Uh, from Babylon, thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. There we go. It's 
still bopping to that music even though it's done. Okay. Uh, I think this is where we want to be. Oh, I shouldn't have angered that space pirate. Explore up here real quick. Secrets? Secrets? Is this how we get to that part of the map? Okay, these, I keep forgetting we can't kill them. At least, I don't know how yet. Oh, fun. I'm guessing that one's just a shortcut. Oh, hi! It's so slow! Do, 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 do. Thank you! Okay, cool, more map squares. I can't help but, one, but wonder what was up in this other corner, but that feels like the way out, but there's no way for me to know. All of this is gray. The Goomba, yeah, the little robot Goomba is very cute. This looks suspicious. This part is really cool. Is this just to give us enough, like, sprinting room for something? I don't know. Oh wait, we can probably tell if we shoot at the ceiling. Uh, I don't know. The robot's the strongest thing the space pirates have created. It's invincible, yeah. I'm not investigating nearly enough corners of this ship. We're just kind of, we're just kind of checking it out. Uh, ooh, someone dropped health for the first time. Oh, oh, crumble block? What is this little squiggly path below us? I don't know. This feels like we're going through a giant spiral. We missed a room. Oh, what is all this? There's so much stuff. Is this the way that we could have come in with the water? What is, oh, okay. I was wondering about the aspect of the health drops. <gasps> E-tank, worth it. We triggered the thing, but it's worth it. Oh, power bomb tank. That's not an E-tank, that's the power bombs. We got them. It was worth it to come back. Yay. Yay. What's 
what's up here. Oh, so that you can get in here without triggering the alarm, I think. Eh. A lot of left, right, side to side, up, down, all around town. <laughs> Wondering about that. Maybe it was to avoid using friendly fire during stealth to cause health. Oh, interesting. I don't know. I was so confused as to why we didn't have power bombs for the rest of the game. Oh, we only get two? Get four. Nice. There we go. That's how we were supposed to do it the first time. And you can use a power bomb to get all of those at once, but. We don't have unlimited supply. I love the how they drew this. It's really cool. To see the exterior and interior of the ship at the same time. They learn the lesson with power bombs. Are so extreme it makes sense to hand them out later, yeah. Wait, is this the way? Yeah, yeah, let's go get this save. Oh, right, it's not gonna work if we're being pursued. Will the music calm down in this room or not until we go in the next room? I don't know if it will. Okay. And it refills your power bombs too. It refills everything. That's way more generous. It doesn't have, this game doesn't have those separate missile refill stations. Did Super have a bomb refill station too? I can't help but feel like we missed some things, but I think we're just gonna go, we're gonna embrace it and go to this upper section now. Just regular missiles? Just your ship. Oh, that's right. Uh, Elias, hi, welcome in. Oops, I think I wanted to, um... Oh. We're just gonna do that. Here we go. I have a question. I'm trying to so hard to not give anything away, but do you want to continue exploring? Um. Well, are we going to get locked out of this area? I feel like that's probably it. This is all above the other parts of the ship. Oh, look at that. Where does that go? Interesting. Oh, there's no, um, there's like no wall there. So we have to shoot a missile through this little tunnel. Interesting. I don't know that we can get through that yet. 
Well, okay, but this is gonna drop us down. I really wanted to explore this, like, ship and the tunnel above the ship. Should we do that? Okay, I want to explore this little area with the tiny skinny tunnel down there. Should we do that now? Or can I can I go to that? That was- we didn't really look at that big blue thing in that room. You can always revert to your safe, true. It's just so far away, I didn't really want to go back to that corner while we were all the way up here. But I think we are gonna fall somewhere. can 100% any point. Yeah, we talked about that too, which is nice. Um. Oh, interesting. Oh. Okay, well now we're locked out, but it was open at the top there? Oh. Oh, I didn't want to use a super there. Okay, we're- it's okay, we're just gonna- we're gonna go do this part. Oh, Is this what? Not Mecha Ridley, this is someone new altogether. Okay, if this is a boss, then the good news is we'll probably die, so we can go back and explore. You're glowing green, which makes me think it requires supers to 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 uh, damage you. But then you have this like red glowing heart. Yeah, very quick death. <laughs> That was cool boss music. Mecha Ridley is the correct term, but not Meta Ridley. It doesn't look very Ridley. Other than maybe the head shape. Went to the bathroom and it's ridiculous how fast the music <laughs> it gets caught in your game. Yeah, or in your brain. Okay, I appreciate- I do appreciate the answers to the saving and the locking out questions because that's what I care about the most as far as missing sections of the map. But please keep in mind for any- most of the time for game questions, I am thinking out loud and if I'm like, oh, how do I do this? Don't- don't answer that right away. Just let me puzzle through it and try to figure it out. We're kind of at a weird spot where I'm asking a lot of, um game lockout related questions so i'll try to i'll try to commit to a plan at this point we're gonna go back and explore is it really ridley without the ear piercing scream yeah no i don't think so this is that spiral section that i have to go back through right yeah it's very windy The concern thanks to the one moment in Super. And in this game, I was so, so worried on Monday that we were locked out of the rest of the map after Mother Brain on Monday. I was like torn up because I wanted to go back and do more. But it's okay. We are gonna go back. Oh, this looks like... No, there's something going on with this room. There's a room 
to the left of here, but this this must not be how we get to it. Mecha Ridley is actually Ridley's mind uploaded to the machine. Oh, interesting. The lore. Some very intense lore in this game. Okay, cool. I wanted to come back to this room and check it out. Oops. Hello. Because we can't... We can't do anything here. Oh. I thought for sure that we were going to be able to do something here. up there? No. Sorry for last stream's mishap. I wrongly assumed the concern for locking out was no longer a concern once you were chat. Well, and it, it was just a, it's not a big deal. It was just a tough situation because I, I had said like, well, we're in Turian. We're doing this now. So, you know, what did I expect when we went to Turian? I don't know. Um, and, and after the fact, I was like, you know what? I just needed like a day to get back to this uh, with a fresh fresh set of eyes fresh start because I knew I was going to like this section but it really caught me off guard pirates haven't gotten their cloning process down yet still very much like Super Metroid while I dislike save room of no return I do wonder if they had important reasons for doing it yeah probably so we really can't uh Seems like we really can't do anything in here. That's a bummer. Okay. Uh. Oh, there are sections that we can get to with power bombs. There's so much we can get to with power bombs now. Okay, by so much, I mean two gray squares because this one hallway we haven't found uh and this other hallway is with is with um supers let's go do that then since we already walked away from our save was to encourage replayability I was thinking about it and the stream timing was a lesson for us to learn the context of how much longer you planning to stream would have been important yeah, I think it was it was the fact that I had this, and this isn't a good thing, this like image in my head of, oh, it's going to be a map exploration stream, you know, not a big boss fight stream, but once it happened, it's kind of up to me to like change plans on the fly too, so it's all good. It, it, it was a learning a, a learning moment for all of us because I know better how to ask for that sort of question in the future and you all know that there's that aspect that I'm like oh how much longer is the stream gonna go was there something oh maybe we can get to the ship there might have been some item blocking it um that we didn't have when we encountered it before Definitely sympathize with having to walk from a game for a day or so. Yeah! Come back with a fresh mind. Oops. We're getting beat up. Hang on. Dun, 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 dun. I want to go to... The right? And then straight down, I think? Okay. Stop it. Stop it! There. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is what I want to do. Ah, 
<laughs> Shinobi, how's it going? Welcome in. And mom's here. Hi, mom. Uh, do you have a source on that? I don't mean to be overly harsh, but players rarely understand the reasons for design decisions. Oh, that the, the devs made a poor decision? Yeah, I have no idea why they put that in there, and I'm not a dev, so... It's, uh, it's a good point to bring up that... Especially with, like, the Super Nintendo limitations compared to the systems we're used to now. Oh, this room. Yep, this did have, okay, this was locked out. We should save soon. That one uh, mecha pirate or whatever really beat us up. Oh, interesting. Wait. Is this not? Oh, interesting. Interesting! We're going back to the save! Oh, rip. It's cool being able to come back through here now. And look at it again, this part we had our no armor the whole time. This part. Oh, we can do so much now. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We should come through here and do all this. This is this is important. There's a square of map up here too. Oh no, it was just tank no power bomb tank for some reason i keep mistaking the power bomb tanks and e tanks so where does this go what does this starting area look like again we didn't really look around when we were here because we couldn't do much they're both wide oval thingies with warm toned colors they change the shape of power bomb in this and it it i feel like it looks very similar to the shape of the e tank in this game okay now we want to go I don't know, left? We can literally do the entire level all over again if we want to. And go back to that water section. That I noped out of. There's something to the left here, but we don't know how to get to it. Interesting. Hey, J Pops, welcome in. It's good to see you. Happy Wednesday. I'm 
curious about that long vertical room, but apparently not curious enough to keep trying. Uh, let's go get this one first. Ooh. Oh, this room. Yeah, we got trapped in here earlier. Weird. So many secrets in the game, like Super had a lot, but my goodness, there are so many. Mel, hi, welcome in. Doing a complex sugars tier list? Lactose is the worst one? I don't know any other complex sugars. I know fructose and sucrose. Are those- aren't those- one of them is a simple sugar. <laughs> no worries, just my personal thoughts on developer decision. Yeah. Those are simple as fuck. <laughs> Um, what's our game plan now? Ooh. Let's go. Okay, there's only one way to get to the next part of the map, so we have to go through this door, I think, right? Wait, the upper door or the lower door? The upper door, yeah, yeah, yeah. I use my one F bomb of the stream, yep. <laughs> Sucrose is simple sugar. Oh, the game's good, Mel. I really like it. It's a lot like Super, though. In some ways. And I know Super's not your favorite of all time. Do we want to go through... I keep... I have to look at the map every two seconds. Yeah, we want to go left here now, because we're going to go explore this other section. Super hurts your hand. That's fair. I've been doing a lot of wall jumping in this one, but it's not required most of the time. Favorite Metroid is the Game Boy one that no one likes. Other M? Is that a Game Boy one? That's the one no one likes. Very controversial take. It's not nearly as technical. Yeah. It, it, it controls really smoothly, this one does, compared to Super. It doesn't require lots of tricky technical things. Um. Oh, maybe there's a... Okay, hang on. an exit through the ceiling. Ooh, so sneaky. You're making me waste my supers. This room is terrible. Okay, well, those th things keep avoiding me. I was wondering if the entrance to that other room was above us. But I may never know. Because I don't want to stay in here. It sucks. Other M was on Wii. Oh, okay. If all wall jumps are the same as Super Metroid, I'll get this game just so I can delete it. <laughs> All the movement mechanics are different. It does have a lot of Shine Spark puzzles, but they're not required to beat it. So far as I know, we had we didn't have to do any of them. 
Uh, I just wanted to do a bunch of them that didn't even exist. I feel like there's a door up there. Metroid Other I made Samus very whiny and you didn't get to actually kill all the bosses. Gameplay was cool and different. Enjoyed the core, but wanted to destroy the disc because of everything they did on a narrative front. That's yeah, the most the biggest complaint that I've heard about Other M is that no one likes the story. The way that they changed the lore. Why am I so convinced that there's something, some entrance or whatever? I feel like you can space jump midair in this game, which is cool. Didn't feel like a Metroidvania, gotcha. There's a story in Metroid, I thought it was about a small ball who becomes a lady and also the wall jumping is bad and no one can convince me otherwise. Strong opinions. Can we, um, break the glass like we can in Super? Yes, we can! Okay, fun. Did this serve a purpose for us? Oh, yes. Neat. <laughs> Proud. <laughs> This is the first time- no, it's the second time we've been back to a glass tube after picking up power bombs. Whoa, what? This is a massive drop off. Also, speed boost blocks. Also, what? It's over here. Is this gonna be a giant tunnel down there too? Oh, this is the room we were looking for. It's raining pirates. want this. Okay. Cool. Looking through the credits of other I'm trying to find the for any women in leadership position zero found so far. Oh no. Not a great sign. Okay, I guess I want to go investigate what's over here. Do we dare? Should we save first? How far away is a save? Uh, not that far. I think. Oh, hi. We're seeing so many... Uh, speed boost blocks. Very suspicious. Oh, and now can I not get that because I broke the glass? That's unfortunate. Dang, this is massive. Okay, I'm glad. I- this was- so many like changes of pace for this whole game but i really like exploring this area i'm glad there's lots to do 
Okay, let's save. Mystery pit, yeah. I don't know what's down there. Let's let's save and then go back to that area and look around. I feel like you're hiding something up there. Or you were just showing us that we can hide in places like that in the future. Maybe that was it. The pirate was hiding from me, yeah. True, true. Now we're the scary ones. What movie franchise? Doesn't Alien and or Predator, Alien Predator, the whole entire series was a huge inspiration for Metroid, right? Which I've seen at least one of those movies. I think one came out like a new one, like a weird remake one, and I went to see it in theaters just cuz, and it was okay. Aristocats inspired this movie, yeah. A uh, movie, game. <laughs> Cause Ridley is the, that's where they pulled the name. Metroid 1, 2, and 4 take heaps from Alien franchise, yeah. Uh... I'm missing some... Hmm... These are some beefy paragraphs. I can't keep up with all of them. I'm just like re rehashing, checking really quick. I know you're talking about the um, the lack of diversity on the team back then. Ridley got his name from Ridley Scott. Pretty sure Samus herself is inspired by Ripley. There we go. I forgot the name connection, but I knew there was a couple tie-ins there. Watch the Alien movies and match them up with the Metroid series. Really? Other M discussion is ballooning too much. We do have an entire Zeebs dedicated channel in the Discord if you want to discuss all the Metroids. I know not all of them take place on Zeebs, but that is what it is for. Um, we can do a quick one of these too if anybody's interested. That's where our spoiler chat is as, as well if you're wanting to ask things that would be a spoiler to me. Uh, in a place where the mods are somebody who knows the game. Can answer for you. It went down a rabbit hole. It's okay. I just wanted to make sure I scanned through it really quick, and we're keeping things respectful, which it seems like we are. We're just discussing. Okay. Did I go right past it though? Because I was chatting. Yeah. I kind of went in autopilot. That's alright, we're gonna- we have the save. Wait, why- oh, I don't- I don't know what's going on. We wanted to come back here. Oh, I remember, because I got to this room and thought, dang, I'm really bummed that I lost my ability to shine spark here. And then I got full on distracted. This is concerning. Okay, we're jumping down a hole. Nice. 
Lots of green globs down here. I feel like you should be a save. We saved, and I thought, you know what? I bet there is one when we jump down, but <laughs> let's go back and get one anyway. Oops, but then I didn't use it. Yes. Okay. Now we've got hidden stuff. Oh, I, I, I'm learning to let crabs be and walk around because they'll tell you where hidden walls are sometimes. Although these ones don't seem to. I don't know if there's any in here. Let crabs be. Yeah, I just need to let them be. They're just happy little crabs. like a whole maze. Can you... Hello? <laughs> we kept bouncing. Oh, it was right there. Nice. Spy crab, yeah. I'm glad I was thinking about it when we came over here. Ooh. This is weird looking. Ooh. Okay. Oh, crumbles. I feel like that's gonna be more crumbles. Oh, this is tricky. But also very cool. That's the exit, but there's an item up here, maybe? Aww. We're gonna get it. This is your favorite puzzle in the game. This is, I, I really like, um, oh, hang on. I really like Morph Ball. I love Spider Ball in Prime. I love all the, the puzzles where you have to use the, the magnetic railing. I don't even know if I would call some of those puzzles. They're just fun to get. Samus to move around like that. Here we go. Oops. And follow the little tracks. Big Cat counts as Morph Ball. We do have a Morph Ball one as well, but yeah, Big Cat also counts. Uh, I feel like there's... Is this a thing too? No. Morph ball mazes are fun, yeah. I like them. More parts of the map we haven't seen yet. This looks like a shine spark and or speed booster room. Why is this arrow? Cutscene? Criteria! Right! Oh, hell yeah! We return! There's so much to do! Go to Jorian, please! No. Ugh. So we can do this whole bit 
and just chill. So this is the stream I wanted to have Monday, which is go through the entire map with without a, a schedule or a timer. What does this look like when we exit, though? Does it, like, drop us off a ledge? No. Oh, and we have gravity suit for this area now. Oh my gosh. Yay, collect-a-thon! I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so happy I could space jump. <laughs> I know why they changed it, but I still can't bring myself to call Prime's thing the spider ball after playing... M2, AM2R, it'll always be mag rail ball. Okay, fair. That is a, that is more spot on, objectively accurate version because there's nothing spidery about it. I guess that it can climb walls. They do a good job of not giving you the legit location of the item, just a sense where it could be. Oh, the way they mark it on the map. Yeah, I like that. Backseating, nay. <laughs> Thanks, Otafu. Yeah, so this is the collectathon. We're not playing any kind of, of hot and cold. We're just letting Jen explore and try to find all the items on her own. Um, that's it. That's how it's going to work. Oh, I remember this one. I definitely remember this one. Is this a Shine Spark one? I want to see what type of blocks those are. Interesting. It was called Spider-Ball in Metroid 2 is the true form of it. Yeah. It's just for the transition to 3D, they really had to limit movement to rails to make it even controllable. Yeah. We did not 100% Super Metroid yet. No, Carl. Um, We started... We did the randomizer, and then I realized that 100%ing the game would benefit me in doing the randomizer. So we started doing 100% off-stream, and I don't remember where we left off. We, we got pulled away to do other games. Ignorance becomes excitement through personal discovery. Dang, I can't spell today. No, I read it. You spelled it perfectly. Free Roam Spider would have been chaos on room puzzle design. Yeah. Okay, well, I don't know how to get that, but we have so much we can do. As far as map squares, oh, we have this room now. Where does this take us? This reminds me of, also reminds me of the gauntlet. Oh, what is this? Back to Trozodia. Weird. So many connecting hallways. I can pop down here, right? I feel like this is gonna lock me out. No? Are we gonna drop down somewhere? This looks like a tunnel to the left. Yeah, and then that'll lock us out, I think. But there's something in this corner of the room. Is it in this little tunnel? No? We already did this, right? It's a pain to 100% Super Metroid, but very rewarding. Yeah. Post ship crash is the moment of oh no, where am I? Hello, giant burp head. Have a bomb. Yeah. I love the moment of finding out it's connected. I get it now. I was not obviously expecting that. But I still 
Maybe in the future I need to ask about one-way doors at all. I don't know. I don't know how you all could have told me without ruining the surprise of this, because this is a cool surprise. Mistake high. Cool map design, yeah. I don't understand, uh... Well, it's not up top, it's in this lower section. Did we bomb the ceiling here? One thing I love is they gave power bombs the x-ray scopes feature. I hated using that thing. I love the x-ray scope. I remember just going through the entire game bombing every wall. Yeah. Um, the surprise was that we have access to, like, the whole map. That everything is connected. It's very good. I'm also getting taco mix all over the keyboard. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. You want to see the map mistake? This is what it looks like. We just found out that there's two connections from this big area called Chozodia. At least two, maybe more. And it goes back to Criteria, our starting zone, which is so fun. This is a good map. <laughs> it's a rough situation, but I think the key thing was we had failed to ask what you wanted which then made the trust us moment harder to believe. And I would never be like, oh, you all lied to me. That's not what I, I felt. I just, it was like the unfortunate miscommunication of it. I guess we're doing this. There's gotta be some cool. Oh, is this what we want? Wait, hang on. Nope. I don't know. Try not to spoil before Mother Braid. Yeah, 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 exactly. It's all the same map, always was. Mm -hmm. Tin Pin, thanks for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. Um, how- I know we've been with this music for a while. It's feeling a little bit loud to me now, but it's- it's good, right? I feel like the Criteria theme goes so hard. Alright, I don't- wh why am I hesitating here? I don't know how to get this item. And I'm not seeing any... blocks. Are we supposed to do this? Yeah, so sneak. So sneak. I feel like I missed, um, I bombed the the wall on the right hand side a little bit, but I didn't bomb the entire wall. Audio's well mixed. Thank you. I appreciate it. it I think because the theme is going for a while, it's like, is this grading? Is this, is this okay? Map fix the issue, Super Metroid's map where you couldn't tell if the item was already picked up. Oh, I know, I love that. Red Star theme does not get repetitive. Oh, does get repetitive, a little bit. If I had to choose, still getting taco mix on my keyboard, by the way, that's how serious I am about maps, then I'm gonna go with Wind Waker. Is your favorite? I missed the question, but I, I'm glad you uh, has the best map, yeah. Good to know. Oh, can we shine spark out of this bird's mouth out into the wilderness out there? Oops, okay. I need to not walk through that door though. Won't that be cool? Does it give us enough room? The music is okay, but it's a good point that it's no longer a good match for the gameplay. Yeah, something would be, something a little more chill since we left that area. But there's like not enough downtime on this ledge for me to do it. Oh, but we can, I always forget that you can get this door as you're running. 
So we can go as far back as we need to. Oh, I did the controls wrong. It's okay, we're, we're gonna do it. It's gonna be fun. I don't know if it's worth it. Should I look at the map when we're on this side? I feel like it's gonna be worth it, right? Wee thud, yeah. My, uh, my shine spark capabilities are not so hot. Wait, what? We can do that now? Okay, we are not high enough to go anywhere cool, but now we know how to do the morph ball version of that? Weird. Oh, and it's literally right above that? Do we have to go from the other side? Ball spark, that's what it's called. Uh, yeah, it looked kind of cool. I know I love how it doesn't drain your health. Exactly, Carl. What's over here? Map squares. Have we gone in this door? Yeah. You know, I'd find Ball Spark without chat. Was that something that we could have done earlier, but I, I hadn't messed around with it yet? Because there were lots of places where we saw. I feel like there's places where we've seen Ball Spark. Maybe not lots of places. Also, is this. Did I just do it a little too early? Interesting. We are, Sammy. Hey, welcome in. We're gonna try. We're going for secrets and, and map stuff today. Oh, I forgot we haven't had our stream break yet either. We will do that soon. Acrylic, welcome in. It's purple Samus, yeah. There's at least one person who wanted to say the ball spark thing. No, we found it. Baffled by the health drain. Mm-hmm. Ball spark is new. But we saw clues that, um, that, that made it seem like it was possible. We saw a bunch of clues. I was, I was looking at it. Oops, I forgot to shoot. Looking at it in this one room for the longest time. And I think it's just a shortcut in that room. I don't even think it was a secret, but I really was curious what that was going to turn out to be. Nope. Aw, oh, shoot. Gravity has the best color scheme. No. Weird. Very strange. Okay, Maggie, sounds good. Thanks for the reminder sort of thing where there probably was good reason for health drain at some point, even if it was no longer applicable. Yeah. Hmm. You're a sucker for purple Fenris. Nice. Come to cause chaos. Sykes, no. <laughs> I like the blue and purple in Prime 1. Yeah, that was a cool design too. Some of the items are sneaky, sneaky, so I've been told. I know. We'll see how we we'll see how we do. I've already I'm already puzzled by this. Okay, is it is it actually back further? Do we have to do it right here? Can I tell by doing this? No. And now we're just using all our power bombs. Uh, 
Is there something? Is there a good running surface in this area even? No. I don't think we have enough room to build up a... a sprint. We do, but what does that get us? Oh. Oh, those blocks regenerate, okay. sure then other than it coming from over here I didn't use a power bomb over here mm -hmm. uh, Jay Morph thank you for the follow thanks for supporting a fellow human does this go higher up there Shine spark puzzles. I'm assuming that's what this one is, but I don't know where to build up our running capability. Oh, I remember this little divot down here. This is the one we don't know how to get. There's crumble blocks here. Oh, right there. Interesting. And this one... I feel like we have to jump up from below to get, but that we haven't figured out yet either. Does this one have... One of those weird blocks that... You have to shoot a missile into the small tunnel? I don't know yet. I was watching one of the other episodes, new question about green and blue squares on the map. Oh, that's the type of weapon that opens the door, I think. Or something like that. I feel like it had something to do with how you can access that area. Amazed at the sort of effects they managed to pull off in Super, the x-ray was tricky. below here? That big room with the water, right? Yeah. Can we run down here now? No, because that has little stepping stone areas. Interesting. Did we get this item? Yeah. Really enjoying the stream, but I have to cook dinner. Okay, Cabrera, thanks for hanging out. Have a good dinner. I'm glad you got to stop in. We'll see you around. Oh, wasn't the x-ray visor done by using mode 7? I don't know. The weapons have a little to do about the color tiles on the map. Um... And we know the orange rooms that flash are the heat ones. 
I don't know, don't tell me yet. Maybe it'll become apparent as we're searching for more items. I wonder if there's something hidden in the ceiling here. in here? Yeah. Maybe? Hmm. I like that Zero Mission blows up multiple bomb tiles at once. Yeah, I do like that too. I guess we can refill our... Power bombs, because we've been using a lot of them. Should we just use one in here? To see if there's any tiles that we want? This one definitely has me... Both of these have me puzzled. I wonder if you have to do like a diagonal? Can you do that in this game? I assume so. Don't answer that. Let me try it. That's like the one thing I didn't try yet. Oh, except we can't... I don't know. Oh, okay, well, we did one and it was really cool. But I feel like we did it in the exact wrong direction. How... How is that gonna work? Okay, I can't shoot that early, that's fine. We have to do it on this ledge, right? Maybe it's... I don't know. I feel like it would have showed us where more of the blocks were. Because we power bombed this whole ledge, and these are the only blocks we could find. And it doesn't show us ones below it. Drupal, how's it going? Welcome in. <laughs> I used to be a fan of artificial sweeteners, but agave tub. I gave it up. I get it. Um, <laughs> can give a slight tip without giving the answer. Not yet. Nope. Not yet. But thank you for asking first. What else have we not tried yet? Oh, that time I just straight up didn't shine spark. If you lose all your HP, you'll lose. This is true. I'll try not to do it. We're in a pretty good spot right now, though. Regarding HP. You know what? I think I'm gonna step away for a minute. And, uh... 
think about it and take our little stream break because we normally break at like two hours, two and a half hours. It's almost three hours of stream and we haven't taken a break yet. So uh, before we do, we had two cat cameos redeemed today. Let me go grab a cat to share with you all. And then we'll take a break. timing. Here's Bibi. Look, she's all cuddled and <laughs> in snuggle mode. Chai and Number. Well, Number didn't redeem the cat cameo. Number asked about it and I said we would do it at break, so thank you for the cat cameo. Thanks for being so patient. This was perfect timing to wait for break. <laughs> Yeah, this is BB, also known as Beatrix Kiddo. I'm glad you like her, Carl. She steals the show. I have another cat, Duncan. He was up on top of the cat tree, but maybe he'll say hi later. Do, do. Yeah, she's very relaxed. I don't think the microphone, I don't know if this will pick up her purring. Sniffing the microphone, sure. Yeah, she's comfy. Break time equals more wine time. Wine sounds pretty good right now. Wine Wednesday? <laughs> I don't think that's gonna help us 100% the game though. <laughs> I'm just letting her chill. She's so agreeable right now. She's loving this. She's not trying to go anywhere. Oh, I know the lights are bright though. You probably don't like that. Give you some ear scratches said anything about helping with the game <laughs> as long as it's not Chardonnay mistake and I ever ever going battle of Chardonnay being delicious versus the other opinion <laughs> it's actually not I don't have Chardonnay I have um what do I have the pink one forget what it's called oh white's in which I don't normally get, but we decided to give it a try. Love Moscato. She's so calm and relaxed, I know. No, not Rosé. Uh, but close. Alright, thank you for the cat cameo. Here, she's gonna sit in my lap for a second while we go to break. I'll see you all in five-ish minutes. Thanks for hanging out, I appreciate you. Welcome back, humans. Had a nice, quick little break there. Hope you got to get up and stretch and relax. Grab some water. Love on your pets. Let's get back into the game. This music is far more relaxing than our uh, Brinstar Criteria fanfare. But we're, we are going to go back to the game music. Ready? All right. So I still don't know how to get this item, but <laughs> we can keep trying. Lo-fi beats to study in 100% too. Yeah, we could we could just use our own music if we want to. If we get tired of this music. Oh, and I did grab a glass of wine, so cheers. Okay. We got this. I don't know what we're doing, but we got this. I can't help but feel like it's right inside. Maybe it's not. Did we look at this room? Is it somewhere in here? I don't know how thoroughly I looked at this room, but it doesn't look like it's in here. Thanks, 
Thanks for the welcome back. Our mission continues, although it's feeling... It's feeling futile. I don't understand... Okay, how long... And what types of things you can do when you're holding a charge like that. When you're holding the speed boost charge. Because there's got to be a way... To like, oh, well, not when you jump off the ledge. I don't know. I'm gonna do this again. Yeah, see, there's not blocks above or below. That's what's baffling. So you have to, like, carry a shine charge somehow that I don't know how to do. Oh, rip. Time for science. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Some science experiments. I keep stopping short of that door. That's your blanket recommendation in games. Yeah, we love science in games. That's the only way we're ever going to get our answers. How do I not stop before I go through there? What if I stop way short of the door? And like charge it and then walk through the door? Weird. Oh no! I'm too slow! Okay, well we learned that we can, um... It sounds like we're holding a charge while space jumping, which is interesting. Hmm. No hints only popcorn. <laughs> Admiral, welcome in. The mission does continue. We are item hunting searching, looking for secrets. Oops, I didn't mean to press that button. Okay, rip. This is, this reminds me of, what's the one in Super where you have to go through Meridia and like do that weird, that weird uh, shine spark in that one water section. I don't know. The hardest item in the game. Supposedly. Mm. Perfectly with the piece of seaweed. Yeah, I know we got it. I'm proud of that. There's some others that we weren't able to get, but we got that one. Well, we were... What were we not able to do? The green gate glitch was really tricky for me. I think I did it once on accident, and that was it. Couldn't get it twice. No! How? I'm not getting the sideways jump. I'm hitting... A, and then arrow instead of arrow and then a Looney, hi welcome in happy time zone felt smart as heck as a kid when i got it but it was fiddly yeah oh i i heard myself stop the sound cues are really good i'm just 
not getting the timing. That's great, nice. <laughs> I like the crate emote. I hesitated at the door because I was afraid I was gonna shine spark to the left. We don't have to go back that far either, I'm just scared. There's no way! That's annoying. Maybe we have to, like, get to a point... ...here? Do we have to just go up high enough and then to the right? But I don't think it works like that. I think once we're airborne... I don't know. Okay, press the wrong button. It's fine. Getting closer. We need a Krogmire emote, yes. Okay, Celestial, I appreciate the support, but just watch until I get it, because I feel like when it's, oh, you're almost there, you're close, that's also giving away some of the, like, whether I'm getting it right or not. It'll be okay. We'll get there. Oh, nice. You have a Croc one. I do think we need to shine spark in the air. It's okay, I know, I know, it's exciting. Just remember, I like even if we're solving it, the questions are still rhetorical. I think that's why I needed to do a quick reminder. Oh. Trav, hi, welcome in. Happy Wednesday. Crocomire one would need to be crying, yeah. Immortal Croc, as he should be. Mm -hmm. How do we... Like, I don't think we can decide to shine spark midair once I start doing the thing. So do we have to land here and then do it? Maybe. Croc did nothing wrong, I know. Croc was just chilling in North Air. Yay! I did something right! Yay! We got it! Whew. After much struggle. There it is, the aha! <laughs> we were getting- we were getting close, I know. That's- that's why, uh... <laughs> we were getting a lot of that because we were so close. Chris the Teal, hi! Thank you for the raid! Welcome in! Thank you so much! How's everybody doing? Welcome! I'm Jen the Human. I like exploration games, especially Metroidvanias. And we are item hunting today. Oh, how's Zero Mission going? Nice! Thanks Raiders, thanks for coming in. Um, we... how far are we? What's a good way to show you how far we are? We've been to Chozodia and back again. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Um, the glasses are from Claire's, actually. <laughs> welcome, welcome, Raiders. Glad to see another Metroid fan. Can't stake his spoilers. Okay, yep, understood. Definitely. No spoilers. <laughs> Dex, hi, welcome. Yeah, Chris Arrayed. Have a good lurk. I appreciate you. Take care. Definitely want you to experience the game spoiler-free. Meeting of the minds. Twitch just wrecked me, so... I checked to, since we were playing the same game. Yeah, right on. Yeah, I must know you already from Dex. I, kn I know the name. I was like, wait, Chris Atiel. Very cool. Enjoying 
enjoy the other item in the room. Uh, please don't. <laughs> That's so many spoilers. I mean, potentially. Like, just say good luck. And I'm directing that at Nintendork because... Even if we had already figured out it was a Shine Spark puzzle, we don't need it, like, explicitly confirmed, you know? I think your name was familiar. Yeah! I think it wrecked because of Dex, yeah. For sure. There we go. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um. We knew this was a Shine Spark puzzle because. There's a crumble block. That's all that we can see. And I think the only thing that kills crumble blocks is shine spark, or if you fall on it from above. Except, yet again, okay, hang on. Did we do this? I forget. Is there a row of them? There's not a row of them. Oh, there's one up there. Weird. The heck? Oh! Oh! Sneaky! There's no block there, it's just an open path. How long has that been there? So we have to exactly line up a ball spark? Any crumblers? Spoilers, nay, backseating, nay. I like that we can see the missile, but Samus is like, why am I staring at this wall? Thank you for destroying the last block. My OCD would have gone wild. We got all the blocks, thankfully. But a comic in Zeeps that the Krakomeyer talk reminded me of, nice. Okay, uh... So we have to... Oh dear. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. Do not like... Okay, but we don't have to worry about any of the other screw attack blocks. Da, 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 da. The music gets so hype again. The skills needed? Yeah, this one's rough. Okay, rip. I think we need to um, at least make, make it past that door, but we need to charge it before we come off of that ledge, because if we don't, we lose the sprinting distance. So now we've got the charge. Ooh, okay, that is exactly where we want to stand, right? Yeah, I think it's just a matter of getting here and then balling up before I do the, the thing. As I said, the music is hype. The stream pitched the music. It does that sometimes, yeah. It knew. It knew it was a hype moment. Oops, I pressed the wrong directional. No, we still got it. But you have to get it before the block crumbles below you. But we did it. They set you up pretty well for that one with that ledge. Once you know what you need to do. I feel like that one's easier than the one on top because there's less walking and jumping and maneuvering before you have to do the, the spark. How long have we been in this area? <laughs> uh... Let's go get the rest of these map squares. Maybe save at, at the same time. Thanks for the hype. Explicit the secret was. I mean, I feel like it was probably a tutorial for Ball Spark. I think where I, we'll we'll stumble upon one that looks like Ball Spark later that made me go, yeah, this definitely is something we'll be able to do at some point. I don't think I had seen those Shine Spark blocks yet in this area, but I could be wrong. 
Anyway, yeah, it is kind of a tutorial. That if you didn't see the other one, then and you saw this one, you would know what you need to do. Ball sparks are cool. Yeah. Glad Samus has the huge shoulder pads always. We're just gonna go um save real quick. Get some of our power bombs back. Not save. Restore. This isn't a save, but, you know. Okay. And we want to go out here. Nobe, how's it going? Welcome in. We're doing item cleanup. We, um... This is not post-game yet. We got to Mecha Ridley, died instantly, and then I decided I wanna, wanted to go explore more of Chozodia and the ship. And then we found that we found the connection to the overworld map, so we're, we're doing as much as we can before we finish the game. That's my plan. Fan of games presenting the challenges that are just out of reach to get the player to rethink what they can do. Love that, yes. Oh, that's a cool noise. We've heard that noise before, but I forget what makes that noise. Okay, we got all of this room. Interesting. Oh, I have this. I took a screenshot of this awesome cliff. I think this area is so pretty. Uh, there's something up there? No. Okay, did we get that whole corner? We did. What do you think of Zero Mission so far now that you know about the connected map and ability to continue exploring? Uh, it's really cool. I really like having everything connected for sure. It is kind of distressing before it happens. Um, I probably made it worse on myself because I wanted... I don't know. I feel like I was so set on getting hints that day when I was like, you all have to tell me if this is endgame and you wouldn't tell me. If I had just let it be and not been asking you a million questions, it probably would have been less stressful. Anyway, it's great. I really like it so far. Uh, and we're, we're... We've made a lot of progress. I feel like this is something. Oops. Indeed. Oh, right. Crumble blocks mean... Okay, so... We have to... Oh, interesting. What else is in this room? I don't have a spot to run yet. Is it gonna be here? Hmm... The scene is so atmospheric. I, yeah, this area is cool. Hitting the sky barrier and super made you take damage. Samus could die from touching the sky. The rain splash, yeah. Super Metroid set, set a bad precedence for save point of doom. Right, it makes, it makes you overly scared. And I was thinking about it after stream, like, because of the similarities to Super Metroid, I can't, I have a hard time separating the two. I think maybe it was... It, it's it's a very different experience playing them so close together versus someone who waited a long time for Zero Mission to come out and played other games in the meantime. I had I just had a hard time being like, oh, right, right, it's not Super Metroid. Or like, you know, the fact that you don't have power bombs by the time you go to, um... Oh, here we go. By the time you go to Mother Brain 
And you're like, well, it's not Super Metroid, so maybe we don't get power bombs. I don't know. But it makes me think I haven't finished the game yet because I don't have gravity suit or power bombs or anything. Unless we were supposed to get them and I just never did. That's fair. Okay, so we have to come from the left, it looks like. Ooh, that thunder, that lightning. Did we get all the squares in this room? Yeah. It's misleading by making you think it's about to end when you have so much left to explore as a completionist. Yes, exactly. Because, and, and, for Super Metroid, we weren't able to do the whole map and then go to the boss, which is what I would have preferred. For Hollow Knight, I knew, like, there was a point of no return. So I personally was like, I don't want to look at my game percentage until it's as high as I want it and satisfied, and then we'll go look at our percentage and we'll beat the game. So we didn't see my percentage until we got our 107, right? 107? 106? Now I can't remember, it's been so long. That's how I prefer to do things. It's like, no, I want to do it all until I'm satisfied, and then we'll go fight the boss. And then you get to go into the boss with like all the extra E-tanks and missiles and all the good stuff. Can we not get past, uh... Can we not go out that way? Oop. Could find, I think Super Metro is the only game that did that. On a per Metroidvania basis, it certainly seems worth knowing about, yeah. Maybe it's not the from that side. Maybe we have to carry it over from this room? I was wondering where the ship was and forgot it went boom, yeah. Ship is gone. We can't carry it from that side, I don't think. Maybe this upper door? What's up here? Oh, we're at the upper door. No. Sorry. Yeah, this is the upper door. What's the lower door look like? Brave ship. Our poor ship. Huh. It looks like this. Interesting. Oh, I know why we can't get back, because this is how we escaped from Turian. Right? So maybe we can't do this yet? Is this one you can only do during the escape sequence? That's evil. Oops. You're not able to see your percentage in game, so when I was in my Super Metroid completionist run, I was like, well, I sure hope I collected everything. Yeah. I tried doing some more research during the break, couldn't find any more on why. I did, however, find a ROM hack that just unlocks those doors. Nice. Okay, I feel like that one's got me stumped. Because I feel like we don't have a way to carry a Shine Spark over from the right hand side of the room. And I could be very wrong. Whee! What if we just run in place? We haven't tried that yet. If we jog back and forth, do you build up enough momentum? No, that's not how it works. This is such a bummer. Alright, uh, I guess we gotta go back. 
It's probably a story thing. You've been hit by the baby and Samus wants to see it through to the end. The plot interfered, maybe. Maybe that's it, yeah. Goodness. I feel exhausted by searching and we've done two rooms. <laughs> I guess we're going back to Chozodia. Was watching the gaming Brith show play Super Metroid, and when they beat the game, everyone freaked out because they finished with 420 time and 69% items. Oh my gosh. Nice. Huh. We want this one. I guess it doesn't matter which one we use. This is gonna take us back. Oh, hello. Oh, we can get back just from that one little door. Nice. Oh, we're back on our quest. Okay, let's go. There's a couple big rooms coming up ahead. Let's try to get those. we want to go, right? Yeah. Oh, this is a power bomb moment. We couldn't get this before. And there's a big room here, so let's explore. Oh, we just, okay, we, we did this, but we died when we fell down to this little section because we were squishy. Well, that part was easy. Let's go up here now. There's a one-way door up here? How do we get around to that then? Go the long way? Yeah. Okay. Can we get back up there? that bomb of a wall up there? What kind of secret is this? Can we get back up that to that part? I don't think so, unless we do this the whole way. Oh, I'm not that good at these. You just hit this button a lot. We got a couple of them. Oops, we got seen. Okay, hang on. I've given you a couple warnings, so just just chill, please. We told you how the uh how the rules work. Don't answer my rhetorical questions. And these are crumble blocks, I think. Oh, I think I got it. Oops. No, there's not a separate backseating command. 
Oh, what? That's just vomable. Oh, was there an item there? No. Weird. Okay. Rip. Metroid players and spoilers. The forbidden love. Oh my gosh. Uh, Parker, thank you so much for the resub. Thank you for seven months. I appreciate it. Welcome back to the human race. Enjoy your Earth badge, your emotes, your ad previewing. We're very glad to have you. You're progressing towards the end goal in an expedited yet reasonable pace. Uh, yes. I think so. We're certainly having fun doing it. We have to go the long way around at the moment, though. That's not as fun. What is this? What is... What is all this? Oh, that just... Okay. Is that to help you hide? I think so. Sometimes you gotta take the scenic route, yeah. Well, we gotta recheck for secrets now that we know more things. I don't remember this part. Secrets is something I had picked up from another channel when I first heard it said. Nice. <laughs> I like it. Sneaky secrets. Oh, this lovely statue. A legend. I feel like we haven't saved in forever. The Chozo didn't want their stuff destroyed. They shouldn't put all their goodies behind destructible walls. And they shouldn't made shouldn't have made everything accessible by all the weapons that Samus just happens to have. Well, but they're they're Chozo powered, inspired. Is her technology all Chozo technology anyway? Then that makes more sense. Knowledge just means backtracking to get more secrets. Mm -hmm. I love it. Her suit is Chozo made. Okay. The bombs are the Chozo version of door key fob. Yeah. Crappy emergency pistol is... GFS Tech. We can just. Okay, we're still making progress. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember this room. I feel like we did this room a lot. Oops. She's a full Chozo infused beast, yeah. Lots of Chozo tech. Is this the secret? Those are crumble blocks. They really don't want me to go up there, but then what's up there? Is it something cool? Nope, just more crumble blocks. Oh, interesting. This was blocked before. Come to think of it, going by culture is Samus Chozo physicality entirely set aside. Yeah. 
Does that question ever get fully answered? Oh, we want to drop down this this lowest level here. Hello? Oh, weird. I wonder why that is. The song has a specific part where the bass gives a low-pitched hum. It keeps making me think my phone's vibrating on the table. Oh no. Okay, this is the section that we abandoned to go do other stuff. This is right after we got our stuff back. And then we got the gravity suit. And there's like a water section coming up, I think. Although this is a one-way door, so we should not go that way. Did we finish this area then? Where was the water? Why am I remembering all this water and we haven't seen it? So what other parts am I trying to get to? Let's go... Yeah, let's just go up through here. Seems... That's intriguing. Very intriguing. Okay. Uh... Do we want to go to the left and grab this save block? Not really. Let's just keep going up. It's a ceiling. This is where we get our charge, right? Yeah. Is this platform alone enough though? It's not, right? Oh, and there's something in the way. So that's not it. Interesting. The spicy water isn't spicy anymore, yay! We love that for us. I have to, I have to keep looking at all this. Was that a point of no return? Probably. Those aren't anything? Is this just blocked now because we can't go back there? Because that was the temple? Probably. Here's the water. I've been looking for you, water. Did we finish this part then? I don't know, let's save really quick. Just came to mind as a sci-fi exploring humanity sort of thing of would Samus think of herself as a Chozo? as human something different. Yeah, I, I get what you're, I see what you're getting at, Austin. Like, she's got Chozo-infused DNA, but does she consider herself one of the Chozo? Does she identify with humanity, with the human race? Where does she fit into things? It's interesting. Save, yes. Okay. Good stuff. Was this a one-way door, too? I think it was, right? Oh, not anymore. Okay. Oh. Uh. Let's go in there? Is this one way? Not anymore.
Oh, this room. Oh, we just destroyed all the blocks. In all my time playing this game, I never knew you could blow up the wall in the save room. There you go. Now you know. I mean that even if Samus was physically 100% human culturally whether or not she might be culturally chosen. Yeah, it's cool. I like the musings. Now we know. And it stays blown up. Interesting. I don't need to save again. I just ran around that room and did pretty much nothing. Uh, girl Bobot? Welcome in. How's it going? Oh, huh. But we did this. We got this. Trying to blow up every wall. Yep. Looking for your path of pain entrance. Oh my gosh, exactly. There's something hidden in here. A whole extra level. We got that one. I think we're good on secrets in this water room. I definitely thought there was more to the water room than there was. Um... And this is all locked. Oops. Did we go up here? There's a one-way door up that we saw. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, interesting. Path of Pain, hey May, welcome in. How's it going? Sam is high-fiving Falco and Smash because they were both raised by birds. Upload me to Metroid Universe and let me do Chozo Archaeology, heck yes. Until Dread, she's like a million things, yeah. Alright. We just need a little bit of time away. Um. We are trying to... What are we trying to do now? Get into the last bit of gray squares on the map before we go back to the boss. We can also go back to Crade, we can go back to Ridley, we can go back to Crateria, to Brinstar. Lots of options. I'm up in this uh, corner. But I think we can go back to the other area now. Been watching somebody play Jump King? Nice. Had to take a break from Path of Pain and then decided to try to fight Radiance. Not sure which has been more difficult. They're difficult for different reasons. Path of Pain, ex similarly extremely difficult platforming are sort of thing I'd love to task, yeah. Bits of Celeste should def have task recommended, yeah. I think these are power bombs, no, oh well. That's all right, we've got plenty of them. Yeah, I think we're just going down and out. Oh no, I forgot about the shine spark in this room. That's right, that's right. But those... Okay, so now... Hang on, hang on. Also, what's with this missile block in the middle of the wall here? Hello? Why are you gonna do that? Is it because this is a tunnel right here? 
Oh, it's because this is a tunnel. Okay, that's fine. Um, if this is not power bombs, then we can run through here, right? Is this enough to give us a charge, though? No. Also, I don't like that I destroyed that block now. Okay. So this hallway is in our hallway. I don't think. And this is a power block hallway. Where does this lead? Not where we want to go. So this is the one where we were... Where's the door where we were crawling? You remember that one time we were crawling? And we had a crawling buddy? Just finished the list. Oh, nice! Oh, I see. Awesome game. Very cool, Carl. Congrats. Jump King is like getting over it had been made as a Super Nintendo platformer. So many falls. So many falls. Getting over it is the one... Is that the one where you're inside of a bucket? Or a cauldron? So many deaths. The deaths in that game are a badge of honor. Haven't completed chapter 9 of Celeste. It's incredible, but so dang difficult. Yeah. The crawling buddy room. Cauldron climber. Okay. So this... Some of this stuff has changed, right? Yeah, you didn't used to have to do power bombs to get into this room. Oh, we never explored up here. We just hung out with our climbing buddy and then, or our crawling buddy and then left. So this isn't a shine spark room, unless there's running distance here. Not nearly enough, and it's not a, we're not trying to do a ball spark. We're trying to sprint and then fall down this hallway. And at some point there's shine blocks in the wall, but now I forget where they are. Or was that not this hallway? Oh, I've been, we've been at this for too long. Now I don't even remember where it was. The bucket guy has you cracking up, yeah. Oh, interesting. What are these? Shine Spark, right? So do you have to charge it from all the way down here? Okay, well, we might want to get rid of those. Gittering over it is the one with the cauldron, the key aspect being able to potentially lose all progress if things go wrong. Yep, I've seen it. It's, uh, something. Not my kind of game, I don't think. Oh, I would like to destroy these. Okay, but now we want to go back here. Although, if I figure this out, oops, rip. Um, I don't know where we're taking this charged shenanigans. Where or why? What am I doing? <laughs> Was there even an item over here? No, I just saw shine spark blocks that I really wanted. Is it to get us to this gray hallway?
Is that what's happening? Right here. Yeah, it is this ledge. Okay. And it is parallel to this gray hallway that we don't know how to get into yet. Which we can't tell if there's an item in the gray rooms or undiscovered rooms, but we know there's not an item in this particular hallway, this green one. They changed the style of the speed blocks. I don't think I really compared the different blocks other than power bombs. That block looks so different. enough distance to charge that well we just have to go far enough to charge it and then walk back no oops Might be purely aesthetic choice, but it just now made me wonder if maybe it was some sort of readability refinement. Maybe, could be. Why does that not work? I thought we could I thought we could destroy crumble blocks. Okay. It's fine. What's going on up here? This gives us running distance for something, right? Maybe? I don't know. I wanna do this. Ooh, what's that? Huh? 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 Jen the human saves the human race! We're trying. But that's not enough running distance either. Which makes me think we have to go over here. Okay. Man, I really do wish we had some other music for this. I am over this fanfare. We're gonna do lo fi beats to find secrets too. I've decided. Thank you, Fanfare. Oh, I needed... We just need a chill moment. Ah, uh, yes. I can relax. <laughs> I was asking earlier if it was too loud or if it was grating, and now it's, like, especially grating me. So, if you all were enjoying it, I apologize, but I need a break from that Fanfare. It was fine when we went to that the criteria area with all the rain and like inside the temple, but now we've been listening to the same thing for too long. The one thing I do like about Super Metroid uh, over Zero Mission is the speed boost and shine spark coupled with the dash button and how you're able to exploit the game and do short charges. Yeah, yeah, definitely, Carl. I know, we, we learned how speed boost worked in this game and I immediately was like, what? No short charge? Not that I'm good at short charge or can even do it, but still. Thank you for the hydrate, Carl. We'll we'll um we'll have some water too. Lo-fi beats to find secrets too totally needs to be a playlist. Yeah, it outstayed its welcome. Mm -hmm. Super speed boost is better. Lo-fi beats to read fourth century church histories and lurk too. Oh, <laughs> loony. <laughs> Good luck. Good luck to you. 
So my now I feel like this is too quiet though. Let's turn it up a bit after all that. Um it's maybe like here. Oh what I think we're doing is running, charging, doing that, and jumping. But can we... See, now I'm confused. Okay, we already got... There's an easier way to get this. We did this. I'm overcomplicating. We got this already. Um... Not like that. But we got up there somehow, right? Gosh, I don't remember how we did it. <laughs> because we want to go back out this way and into the hallway with the charge? Actually didn't know you could diagonal shine spark in Super Metroid till like three years ago. Yeah. I still keep bonking my head on the ceiling. Was it here? I do not. I do not remember what we did to get into that room. Oh. Oh. What am I doing with my life? I don't want to just spam power bombs everywhere, but I feel like that's the strategy sometimes. So many bonks. We're constantly bonking our head on the ceiling with these shine sparks. I don't have the hang of it. Okay, well now we have to redo that whole room. Is it, did we get to it from here? No, cause this just takes you to where that missile block is, which I feel like could be important for this puzzle also. But I don't know. I'm truly baffled here. Does this take you into that room? Yeah. Okay, so the, I had it all wrong. That's fine. We're experimenting. Yeah, the, this game has fewer buttons to work with. Exactly. So whatever I was trying to do before, what about... Are these missile blocks? Yeah. This is so curious. I want to break this. And this. I'm tempted to ask... What about, what about up here? I feel like this one's too loud. Um, this is the room where we need to sprint from, right? But how? But how? I don't understand how I'm supposed to carry that charge. 
that whole way. And even still, if we can get it back with us to the other room, we have to remember to immediately jump through there. We're probably going to lose it when we do that. I feel like this hallway should open back up out into that other room. Whew. Maybe all of my assumptions are completely wrong then. Maybe you just, I, I mean, maybe you can only get to those uh, blocks from the other side and not from this side? And, and this isn't enough to to charge a thing from here? No. They had fusion to build off before it. Yeah, it was impressive the way they did this with Game Boy Advance buttons. Okay. I want to ask, is there a way to break these shine spark speed booster blocks from this side of the map, from the left side of the map? Or do I have to get them from the other side? That's what I want to ask. Yes or no, safe word, yeah. So that I know if I need to. There is a way to do it from this side of the map, okay. Like, I'm drawing a vertical line through the wall that the shine spark blocks are in, and I wanna know that it's the left-hand side that I need to stay in. Yeah, question answered, we're good. Not anything more specific than that, yeah. I mean, because that question... Oh, Carl, it's okay. I want, like, the vaguest of, of help ever. Like, I, I use the hint system that we have to only give yes or no answers to questions that I already think I know the answer to. Like, that's how we always start, is I think, okay, I, I have an idea about this. Let me confirm it so that we don't waste more time. Well, not waste time, but, you know, sometimes we can expedite things. A little bit better. Oops. Yes or no answers a lot. Yes, exactly. It's more of a guide that way and it doesn't feel like a straight up hint. We've used hints a couple times though. They can be, we have some very talented hint uh, formulators. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yes or no can be surprisingly useful. And it's it's just really nice when I know you I know you all like chilling and seeing me explode every single wall with a bomb. But sometimes when I'm convinced there's something to do and there isn't, uh then I say, "Okay, wait, am I wasting time?" and you're all like, "Yes, Jen." <laughs> and we can move on with our lives. Is there not a block right here? No. Those walls had it coming, yeah, for sure. The real final upgrade is the friends we made along the way. The only time yes or no failed us was the Fantoon save room. What happened at the Fantoon save room? I don't remember. Should we save? How did we get this low on health? What did I do?
You asked if powered off save room was usable or not, and it was yes, but technically no. Oh. Yeah. That's a tough one. I got really scared because the save was not usable yet. Ramming your head into walls enough times will hurt your health. We have been running into a lot of walls. This is such a tough one. Pretty strict on spoilers too. Many chatters have ruined entire games for me. I hate that. I'm so sorry, Carl. We, ugh. And, and we've had like extensive discussions, especially in the Outer Wilds Discord, about going into streams to watch like a spoiler free playthrough and hoping that the streamer and the mods have a good system because once like one person starts giving instructions and the streamer latches onto that it can be really hard to go back to okay i want to figure it out on my own and like one person will be giving like do this okay did you do this yet and it's it's just oh it's so sad to watch. Or or things could be going completely fine and somebody just comes in and says, do this. And you're like, no, I was getting there. I wanted my aha moment and you took it from me. <laughs> and I wouldn't be so strict about it if we, if we hadn't had some super satisfying aha moments of stuff I figured out and got to, got to be like, I can't believe they did that, you know? The tough, a tough situation. The third option is can't answer that. I know that's a tough one. First playthrough streamers are brave. I don't stream, but if I ever did, I'd never stream a game I'd never played before. Really, I that's all we play pretty much anymore. I love it. Um, it is really hard. Everybody thank the mods because it takes a lot of extra work from the mods. It takes a lot of us talking off screen about off stream about like this is okay this is a spoiler this was not a good move today like recapping things rehashing what worked what didn't so mods are wonderful thank you uh me trying to be helpful but gives too much info <laughs> sometimes but i mean that's why we practice that's why we talk about it too and there's a difference between somebody who's in here really excited about the game Versus someone that's like, you know, with no warning, with no engagement, can't say, doesn't say hi in chat, doesn't say how are you doing today, just comes in and is like, use the L button to, I don't know, whatever. Like, it's frustrating, but, you know, it doesn't happen too, too often. At least not, not lately. May, exactly, I know. You get it. If there are secrets to find our story to learn or story to learn, then I definitely want to experience that myself without other input. And it does, like, I ha I didn't, what's a game? I think Grease was a hard one to stream because I wish going back, and I love Grease and I'm really glad I got to play it with you, but I think that game, if I had been sitting in my room playing it on like switch or something by myself or on pc by myself would have been a completely different experience than streaming it because i would have gotten a little more involved and like immersed in the story and the emotion of it it's such an emotional story that you have to pay attention to the nuance and the color and streaming you're reading chat you're getting kind of pulled away and put back in so phrasing I heard in the video, how the heck do we talk about Outer Wilds was pointing out that spoiling something is an act of taking an experience away from the other person. It's one of those tough things you can't you can't take back. Yeah. Do you unlock the Doritos cannon yet, girl bo? <laughs> Thanks for the Doritos. One streamer I watched had the final boss ruined because one person hated the game so much they emailed the streamer? Ow. I feel like that goes straight to spam folder. Press jump to jump, yeah. All right, I need to try something new here. But from what I know so far, there isn't a shortcut 
through the central column, except, no, there isn't. Right? There's no block. Here, let me do this really quick. Yeah. So that's crumble blocks. That's crumble blocks. So if we charge and jump up here, can you charge and then run again and then charge and then run again and then charge and then run again? How does that work? Oops. Oh, not if I bonk my head into the ceiling. You saying crumble blocks make me want to apple crumble? Yeah, that sounds pretty good. It does- you don't keep sprinting, though. You can keep running, but you don't keep that speed. But we can get up here. Does that help us? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe? This is Sam is doing an exercise routine running laps in a pool. I love it. I miss swimming. I was talking about getting, um... Oh, that was weird. Trying to get maybe a... Oh... A gym membership just to swim in a pool again. And do laps. I used to really... Oh, that is so weird. Really like lap swimming. What? What happened? What are all these asterisks? Trav, take care. Thank you for hanging out. I appreciate you. Have a good time zone. Indeed. Oh, we bonked. I don't know, friends. This is infuriating. I wish I knew how to carry that sprint up here. I was trying to say in Super Metroid and it kept auto-correcting to I'm Super Metroid. Oh, got it. <laughs> I feel like I've used so many, so many, so many, so many power bombs to look at this room. And I keep thinking it's going to reveal something new, and, you know, it doesn't. <laughs> uh. Optimal puzzle strat might be to move on until- yeah, I think so. I think I might have to admit defeat for a while. Maybe we'll learn something else from one of these puzzles that'll make it click here. Like, we have the running space. I don't know. Let's go, um, well, we don't even need to save. I think we seven power bombs is enough power bombs. Thank you for the posture check for me and everybody. Ooh. It's not defeat if you come back later. This is true. Um, so we have to make a long walk, <laughs> or if we don't want to do more of Chozodia, which I do though. I do want to do more of Chozodia. We just gotta start walking back. We just gotta start walking back. That's all we can do. But I think there's a quicker way out than there is in, which is nice. Strategic withdrawal. Hmm. Yes. Da, 
dun, 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 dun. Maybe? Hold on. I had a thought. Oh. No. I was thinking because of those... Because those screw attack blocks are there, maybe you have to do one of those diagonal jumps once the speed boost is charged, but... No, that's not it. Oops. I don't know, that's gonna- that's gonna bother me that we didn't get that, but... Such is life. That's the one-way door. We wanna go... Down and to the left. Oops. Oh, I thought... no? Okay. Oh, this is when remembering the shortcuts that we've learned would be nice, huh? Is this one? No. Oh, so many space pirates everywhere! This is wrong, right? Yep, I'm lost. I feel like games having placeable pins is a relief valve. I need to be able to let go of mysteries. Because it shows you where you can come back to it. It is a nice relief. Oh, if sh should we have exited out? Through that other area? <sighs> I don't know. Let's just keep crossing onward. The more I stop to think about what the best path is, the longer it takes us to take any path at all. And we don't have too much more time left of stream anyway, so... Um, I'm gonna be mindful of that. Let's go! Thanks for the heals! Oops. Oh no, we did a circle. I feel like I remember doing lots of circles in this part before. Oh, I still haven't figured out the map thing. Now that we're, um, now that we're here. And we've been, we've been wandering around for a while. I should spend some more time thinking about that. But it's so odd because... In the middle of one section of the map, you've got this whole area that's blue and this whole area that's green. Dun, dun, dun. Undercover Step Bro. Welcome in. Thank you for the raid. How's it going? How was your stream? What were you playing? If I could get a shout out from one of the mods, please, I'd appreciate it. Hi, friends. Happy Wednesday. I'm Jen the Human. I have been playing through. This is our fourth day of Zero Mission. I was playing Metroid Fusion. Nice. We're doing that next. After this one. Thank you, May. How was it? Are you finished with it? Are you just starting out? Oh, thank you for the 11 bits. I appreciate it. Delver. Thanks for cheering for humanity. Thank you for thanking the mods. Welcome in, everyone. I hope you're having a good day. Um, I don't know how you're playing through your Metroid games. I, I'm doing everything completely spoiler-free, so if you know the solutions and stuff, 
Um, yeah, thanks, May, for that command. Just let me try to let me figure it out on my own. Finish both. Nice. Yeah, this is my first time on Zero Mission. Um, we're kind of trying to clean up the map before we progress to what I think is maybe the final boss, but I'm not sure yet. Oops, I want to go back through here. Yeah, because there's a door up here. But I don't think... Oh, I hate these enemies. Bye! Supposed to be emotes? What's supposed to be an emote? How do you like the zero suit part? Was it frustrating? Oh, it's a long story. I think it's really cool. I had some other frustrations with how the pacing of things was was going basically just uh for stream pacing and things and and also the fear of like Super Metroid the point of no return really got to me with this game compared to that. That's all. Otherwise, I thought it was really different and new and uh it was a chase sequence. But I didn't feel too stressed or scared because they gave you lots of save points along the way, which was nice. I don't know, do you like the, um, the Zero Suit section? This is only my third Metroid game, so I'm still, I'm still learning. You detest that section? Really? Oh my gosh, why? What, what about it? Just curious. I'm sure it's like mixed feelings among fans, but I thought it was, um, I thought it was interesting. I did miss like going for items. I missed, I missed the Metroidvania part, but you get back to it fairly quick-ish and you get all your items at the end, which was awesome. Going from being powerful to powerless. Yeah. Yeah, you just have to, you have to run around and get shot at. <laughs> Uh, where are we going now? Mm, down and to the left. There we go. Oh yeah, and we have been uh, on this section for a while, like right after you get your items back. They do that whole fanfare music. And I got tired of the fanfare music, so we have, for your listening, your listening enjoyment, lo-fi beats to find secret items to. That's what's going on here. In case that was confusing. Stealth sections can be polarizing? Yeah. That makes sense. Trying 100% before completion. Trying! I don't know if we'll do it, but we're gonna spend a little more time getting items before we go for completion, yeah. We're saving a lot, but it's okay. Games need an in-game music menu like Prime. Oh, I forgot about that. We didn't even use that. We should have. I do think stealth is really good at, at like continuing the fear elements from the rest of the game. Sure. Oh yeah, and we did this section, which got us back to... Crit... No. Not criteria. That was that other section. This is how we came in here. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We did this earlier. That was no. That was the way we went into the. We infiltrated because we didn't have any items. This isn't where I want to go. Why? Why did I come down here? I don't know. Just cause. Scenic route. I love the first appearance of Samus in a zero suit. I hated that you get one shot, then die. Also, what is this, Metal Gear Solid? Yeah. Do you think stealth? Oh, I read that one from Looney, yeah. Uh, 
Oh, wait. Is there an item up there? Yes. This area, I'm getting turned around so big. There's so much to do. Okay, this is where we wanna be. Interesting, this gives us enough sprint power in that room. Do we need sprint power in this room? I don't know. I'm gonna go with probably not. you can take quite a few hits I manage multiple escapes even after discovery and taking hits one thing that does irk me about the part is Samus uses the map station and gets the map downloaded when she doesn't have her suit it's on the pistol yeah it makes sense I like it okay this I remember because we kept falling down there <laughs> when we were being chased. And this is where I wanted to come back to to explore. But I still, yeah, we still can't do anything. Okay, I feel like that was worth it to come back though. And investigate and look for more breakable stuff. Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. Alright. Let's save. I feel like we barely left the ship and Chozodia today. We just hung out in here the whole time. But we got a lot done. And as far as the map goes... We've really only got this gray box area, which I'm assuming we have to get to with a shine spark. You know what I want to try though? Can we go directly left from here? Alright, get out of here. I want to look at this room again. Oops, yeah. Fire directly into the wall. That's fine. What was there? Oh, yeah. This room. And we looked really hard for secrets that would lead to this hallway below from here I just I, I don't think that's gonna end up being it I think it's from that other section that we have to get to it but we'll check all these little places on the map for fun I'm learning ball spark and shine spark thank you yeah we learned um well we had done shine spark already I think. I think we tested it out when we got Speed Booster. 
But we hadn't used it a ton yet. Today we used it a lot more. And we got those items with it, which was cool. Um, but Ball Spark I had never done before until this game, because it's not in the other games. And this doesn't... Oh, I think my controller's out of battery. It didn't give a warning or anything. <laughs> Uh, I do have batteries, not in the streaming room. Is that time to call it for the day? I just looked down and the light is out. I haven't replaced it since I got it. The batteries hadn't died yet until now. I don't even know where the wire is for this, if I wanted to plug it in instead. I don't need to dig through that box, um, for now. The controller's suggesting end of stream. I think so. I, th I think I was just over in this section to rem to remember if there were bombable bricks by that one room. I can't even show you on the map because the controller's dead. I have the Super Nintendo controller, but I don't, I don't want to re-register all the buttons of a new controller for this game. Um, it would probably be fine. I don't know. Let's wrap up. Thanks for hanging out today. Let's switch over. Let, well, recap, what did we do? We we got through the ship, we did the zero suit section, we got to a gnarly boss, Mecha Ridley, and we died, and then we decided to go looking for items. 